Hey beautiful, it's Darby. Welcome to my channel. Today I have an ASOS haul for you guys. So if you don't know what ASOS is, it's an online store slash kind of boutique and I'm in love with it. I've seen so many people buy beautiful pieces of clothing off ASOS and I was super excited to try and this is my first kind of bundle of clothes I bought from ASOS so I definitely want to share it with you guys. So what was kind of confusing about the website though was that you can choose at the top if you want a Canadian website, US, UK, whatever. And so I chose Canadian website. So when you're checking out, it doesn't charge tax, it doesn't charge shipping fees. But then when I got to the post office the other day picking up my package, they like whacked me with custom charges. So my purchase was like 300 and something dollars and they charged me $84 of custom charges, which I think is crazy because I only bought four pieces of clothing. So that's like 20 one dollars per piece of clothing custom charges so i thought that was absolutely insane so i don't know if you guys will think this is worth it or not um to order out the website if you are from canada but yeah not too happy about that but anyway if you guys want to see what i did buy from asos i'll do a little try on haul here so you can see what it actually looks like on me and the sizes are super super weird on asos so i want to talk about the sizes just in case you guys wanted to order off that website but anyway let's get on to showing the clothes so the first thing i got from asos is actually what i am wearing right now it's this beautiful jumpsuit and this is my favorite thing that i got from there hence why i'm wearing it and it's so comfortable and why I bought it was because I'm kind of moving into a job where I work from home a lot and I mean I don't want to be wearing my pajamas all the time I mean that's what I'm wearing 99.9% .9 of the time and I was like if I'm going to be comfortable and if I have to be comfortable and I'm going to be in my house nobody's going to see me I still want to feel like half decent about myself and not just wearing like sweatpants and a sweatshirt and gross hair thrown up in a messy bun I at least want to have something that's comfortable but that looks good and that feels good and if I was to run out and get something that I would look half decent at least so this was from um, obviously ASOS but the brand is YAS a Y A S and it's in an extra small and it was $85 Canadian so that is a lot of money for just kind of like a sweatsuit jumpsuit but I think it was totally worth it because I think it is so comfortable and so cute and it fits me perfectly it's a little bit long I guess you'd say at my ankles but that doesn't really matter to me it's really comfortable and doesn't um, kind of fall off my body weird so I thought this was totally worth it the model was wearing an extra small and she was really tall and really skinny so I thought this one would fit me but you'll just see in a second how some other things did not fit me that well but I'm super super happy with this purchase. So moving on to the next item is this super cute jumpsuit and it's called the Daisy Street Jersey Jumpsuit with raw hem and pockets and this one's in a size small and I got this one for $49.84. And guys, sorry about the voice change. I'm just doing a voiceover during this part because actually the first time I tried this on, it didn't fit. As you can see here, it's a little bit tight under my armpits and a little bit tight at the crotch. So when I was actually giving my first review on this, I'd only tried it on super quick. And so I was kind of bashing this piece. But then when I went and tried it on again to show on camera, I actually was digging it. It's not going to be everybody's style. It's my style completely. It's comfortable. It's cute. And it's just easy to lounge around in. So the sizes are kind of weird on ASOS though. This one is a small and my other jumpsuit I got was an extra small. And the extra small was pretty big on me and this one's super tight on me. So just be careful when you're ordering off ASOS. But end result, I do love this piece. So the next thing I got was pretty decent. I've been wanting one of these dresses for a super long time. And I do love the fabric. I do love the color. But what I don't like is that it came with these little like mesh things at the side of the dress, which I'm so not down for. And let me see on the website. So on the website, it doesn't show these things on it. So I'm super confused. I don't know why they wouldn't show that there's like this big pattern at the side. But I don't think you can really see it when it's on. So 
I guess I don't care too much. It's a little bit big. I got this one in a size small and it's called the ASOS Claudia Satin Chiffon Insert Slip. So I wouldn't wear it just as a slip. I'd probably wear it as a dress with heels going out. Sorry, it's not iron, guys. I don't know. I haven't read if you're allowed to iron this yet and I don't know if I'm going to be sending it back. So I do love the color. It's a little bit big, but I mean, it doesn't look terrible and it's a beautiful color. So I'll decide if I want to keep this one or not, maybe another day. So the next thing I got is these overalls. So super, super cute. These ones actually did fit quite nice and I'm obsessed with the back of them. I think this will be super casual just to wear out with some heels, just a casual t-shirt and make it relax but still kind of classy. Um, this one is called the ASOS Relax Soft Dungaree, and this one is in a UK 8, so they didn't have the US sizes in this one, and I'm glad I got an 8, I think it fits quite nice, the fabric is really nice, I love the color, I love the cinching in at the back and in your waist, and this one was $89.75 so I thought this one was kind of worth it as well and yeah I thought this one was a good find. Okay guys so that was everything in my ASOS haul. I know it wasn't very big but I just wanted to show you guys my first experience ordering off of ASOS. So I haven't really ordered much clothing offline and I've always been kind of scared to just for this reason that something's not going to fit or it's not going to look good on me or it doesn't look the same as it does on the model kind of expectations versus reality. But anyway, I do enjoy this and I can make some of the pieces work and I might be sending some back, but I'll let you know down in the description box if I do. So I hope you at least pulled something from this. Um, enjoy kind of watching me. Uh, trying some clothes here, maybe got some fashion inspiration or just simply got some sizing kind of comparison. Maybe I'm the same kind of size as you here. Usually I'm just kind of an extra small, small person. But yeah, these sizings were a little bit weird. Obviously ASO has some sizing kind of problems there because uh, yeah, some of those pieces did not fit me very good. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to give it a big like, and please subscribe down to my channel if you haven't already, and join the team, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, I love you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one, bye.